I'm ready. Here we go again. We have two Shadow Pokemon. Crocodile, Makuita. Image. Speed, minus attack. Can't say I'm a fan, but we work with it. We work with what we got. Alright. Now we go. I'm gonna zoom. Uh, let's see. Blugma is such an easy capture, we might as well. Uh, da -da. Yeah, this will do. Alright. Talk to him. <laughs> it's so funny doing this in fast forward, unlocking the spring cap. Oh my. <laughs> Alright, let's go. I've unlocked speed. Oh sheep. Oh man. Okay. It's a good thing that zero is so crap. But damn did that flamethrower hit hard. Alright, fuck it. Get out there. Hit pretty hard, honestly. All things considered. Alright, well, you know what? I don't feel like taking any more of those. That's as good as it gets. Alright, it's one ball. One ball, one slugma. That's easy enough, right? Come on, get him. Slugma feels like an easy, just guaranteed capture. But yeah, okay. Here we go. Here we go! Uh, what the? Zoom in. Okay. Hey, what the hell? That kinda hurt. That egg buff kinda hurt. Uh, we'll return and do more damage here. Maybe. Let's see. Alright, go. Nah. Still three hits. Actually, yeah. It's a kill. We get that. There we go. This fight took like maybe two turns longer than it should have. Hyper mode. Until next week. Right, everything goes soon. All right, let's see. And we have oh yes, Maki still needs to. Ah, uh, all right, you. You get mad. Mm -hmm. I ran out of commentary. <laughs> it's been three minutes and I'm out of commentary. Then uh, what's that? I'll say there's not much to say on the early game. I played this now. This is the third time going in. So, not much to say. Acid armor. Interesting. After all, I've done this uh, three times. Or this is the third time. So. I'm gonna just speed through this. Why didn't I do this the first two times? I guess I still had hope. Okay, so we have guts here. That's nice. Makuhita cannot take any hits for its life though. Not well as a Makuhita. Mm -hmm. And I think Skip Bloom should be on that red barrel. I do want a Skip Bloom. Because Skip Bloom is status. And status good. Like Sleep Powder, I'm pretty sure. So. Fast Sleep Powder, Flying, Grass type. So. I think it'll be good. 
gotten score on Slugma, the slowest thing on the field right now, so they okay. They did like nothing. I'm gonna knock out the dust tox. Okay, that's okay. Plug my, plug my nuts, I guess, huh? Gotta call him up. Yeah, that's worth. Mm, okay, that'll work. Okay. Yeah, I really slug my nuts off. Huh? <laughs> I take that fifty fifty. Don't take those 50-50s. Wait, missed. Down. Boom. Uh, I actually don't know if two bites would kill. I wouldn't assume so, but... Oh, Crokinaw's faster than the skip loop. Interesting. Scary face. Oh, okay, sweet. It's gonna live dead then. And it might not live to the next one. Contemplatable. I think that's just enough health for Umbreon to knock into red. Might have a sliver. Yeah, okay. Uh, hell. Okay, there we go. Here we are. We're chugging the great ball. One ball. Here we go. Bugma, get it if it don't. The hand comes for everyone. The ball comes for everyone. Everyone gets these hands. That's what I like to see. <clears throat> yeah, you lost, bitch. No, now that I think about it, the ball for this, that's gonna be so wacky. Cause it's like, I'm just fast forwarding it all. <laughs> it's not. Maybe I should stop doing it. Stop abusing my privileges here. So fun. <laughs> yeah. 47. And Crokinaw's 50. I have my uh, doubts, but like, we roll with it, we roll with it. Okay. Now, the big issue is to progress the story, we need to beat up Kale. Eh, uh, okay. This is very instant. Kale should not be an issue. What is an issue is... Um, like how lethal he is gonna be. What's that for? And we have Fluffy here. We already failed the Noctowl and the, the Quagsire. Quagsire would've been huge. Ground type. Not super keen on mischievous, but it is a ghost type. Means I can pull the long. Anyway, more options is good. Oh no! Oh wait, if I pull that mischievous for right now. That turret will not be able to touch. Actually, ghost type might. All right, hold on. Now that I'm thinking about it, I'm now, I'm now selling myself on Mr. Fizz's value. Okay, I... The 
it's so funny how Makita just has like no defense. Like 30 defense. I will say, it is a uh, tough sell. I don't even think Umbria has keys right at this moment. Yeah. Um. I'm just debating on how I would do this. Because Mischievous can potentially fuck up a team. The rest of his squad is... Uh, you know what? We ball. We ball. Giddy. Okay. Ooh, Shadow Pokemon. Uh, let's see. I think it can take two hits. My prediction is it can take two hits. Yeah. Well. It could. Alright, who has uh... Going to Slugma. Switch out Makita. Put in Slugma. That hurts, yeah. Broken all switches out. And then we get it right here. We get a mischievous. It's simple. It's simple. Oh? And it's just like that. Oh. Today is a good day. Much better than the last one. Day I had. Like Saturday? Saturday was fucked. <laughs> that was a fucked up. Sunday was also fucked. Chiefs? What? There's no way. There's no way. One point. One point off. Okay. Boom. Okay. We're gonna get. Dude, is gonna be so hype. Bralgate is gonna be so hype. Ah, oh, yeah. If I can get a fully evolved start, it'd just be hype. Ugh. Yeah, let's go. Yo. Alright. Nope, we have Mischievous. It doesn't even matter what Mischievous does. The point is to limit or minimize impact. But outside of some random bull crit. We should be good. But it probably wouldn't hurt to put Espeon up two levels. That and Umbreon. Yeah, you know what? We'll do that. And also, uh, let's see. Who's gonna be put away for the moment? Mr. Fitz, ooh, it has spell tag. Pretty cool. Levitate, ooh, levitate's good. Alright. That's why it's Shadow Balls kind of hit hard, huh? Alright, so swap out Makuhita for now. Fit Makuhita. Man, it's been raining all. Ooh, uh, my eye twitching. Yo, I'm here. Hey, crazy for games, what's up? <laughs> How's it going? So, uh, I hate to break it to you, but like, the last run, like, a few electrodes kind of wiped me out. They kept hitting those thunders. <laughs> yeah, you lost. I indeed lost. And so we have another run. We have another attempt. Yep. But, this time, things will be different. Got a whole team. We have a whole squad here. 
Got a bit of kale. But kale's fur is kind of nasty, so. I think I'm just gonna like try and get Umbreon, Espeon up to 30. That way they can just tank it a little bit better. Uh, you watched Lurk? Ah, okay. Man, it was rough. That Shadow Lab? <laughs> Man. I didn't remember it being that bad. But it's all electrodes in there. Electrodes? <laughs> it was crazy. Those electrodes. And I made a few misplays too, but... Man, those electrodes kind of fucked me up with Rain Dance Thunder. That was wild. I need a ground type for that place now. I really need one. Unfortunately, I did not get Quagsire here, so... I'm not sure what the plan is for the lab yet, but when we get there, we get there. Hmm. Okay, so we have Slugma up. Oh, actually, we have Yawn straight away. Kind of nice, actually. Putting Yawn up. Okay. The, what is Gipbloom's first thing? What's his first move? Uh, wait. I don't exactly do I... I don't want to fight this guy with a Quagsire. Gonna beat me up a bit. Quagsire is no joke. Not my ducks done. <laughs> ducks done? <laughs> Uh, let's see. Ember. Put out our boy Crokinoff. I'm unlocking the fast forward feature. Make the grinding go easier. Doo -doo -doo. Man, the zero lives in Shadow Rush. Interesting. Okay, hi from the shore. Ow! Okay, we have surf now on broken off. That'll be good. Ow, three times. Ow. Yeah, the Espeon's gotta go. Espeon gotta go. Oh wait, we can put in Mischievous. Ghost type feels nice. I can make that Furt fight a lot safer. Okay, ooh, crit. Did show it, but oh man. It's not gonna unlock it, any of its gauge easily. There's like no progress on that bar. Gotta be stubborn. Okay. Fast forward, fast forward. and repeat. Oop, 
Wrong girl. Not ready for Flappy yet. Not ready for her. We have sleep powder. Okay, this is better. This is just a better lead then. Okay. Dang, I didn't think Skip would get sleep powder straight off. I thought I'd get like a cotton spore or something. That's huge. Oh. Interesting. Interesting maneuver. Using absorb on the grass flying. Four times resist. Sell it, Mr. Bird. Mm, I don't think I fought this guy yet. Ooh, it's got birds. We switch you out. Well. What a mischievous. And it hurts. Here's the claw. Slacking off this turn. Loping around. Okay. Boom. It has 47 speed. Plus attack minus speed. Okay. Surf the first round, get rid of no more, knock out of zero. Perfect. Four times weakness. Ooh, crit. I hit crit on both. If I read that correctly.
Ooh. Crit again? Okay, okay. I like it. Ow. Crit. Four times. Nasty. Rude. Some double team and stuff later. It's not gonna be as hard hitting as return. If only Swift was what's it special like it is in later gens. Alas, Gen 3. Alright, we'll get rid of return. Espeon's all leveled up. Now we'll get rid of Law. me. Double knockout. <laughs> Croakin was going on a killing streak with those crits. Yeah, it might be a quieter day for commentary if I'm just going through all this again, so...
Bars. Now Mr. is gonna start getting XP. Okay, 74, pretty even split right now. No, oh, almost. Just got a little sliver of that second bar left. Okay, 2582. And ninety. Yeah, so I don't think the team is so bad so far. Krokna, Sogma, and uh, Giplin. That's a decent comp. Like triangle, water, grass, fire, triangle. Uh, not terrible.
Okay, and after this fight, it should be level 30 for Umbreon. And we can go beat up Kale and progress along the story. Get up Sunken. Oh, okay. Let's go. Now we fight Kale. Here's the setup. Here's the lead. Mischievous up first. So it's Ghost. That's one immunity. Espeon goes straight for Reflect and then bounces out. We're gonna get that spurt. I can feel it. A rip, and then a rolls. That rolls shouldn't be too bad. Uh, let's see. let's see. Hopefully, Mischievous is faster than the Urit. We can land that confused ray. But if not, no big deal. Okay. Oh, oh, perfect. He even hit it on. Of mischievous for whatever reason. He just tried strength on mischievous. This was a free turn. This was a free turn. I like it. I like it. Imprisoning. Okay. Oh, imprison hits both foes. Interesting. Well. Not like uh, what the Espeon was staying in any longer anyway. But we're gonna put in Skip Bloom now. And we're gonna put that Sleep Powder on. Hit yourself. Perfect. Oh, uh, this is going swimmingly. Give it a little soften up. Okay, yeah, yeah. Shadow Rush. Boom, perfect. Okay, so it's gonna prison again. Interesting. Alright, Brods, you do your thing. I do my thing. I do sleep powder. Oh, and he keeps trying to hit the mischievous. That's perfect. That's perfect. Okay. Mm, I like this. I like this. Okay, we hit the sleep powder. It can take one more shadow rush. And then the rest of the fight is free. It's free from there. Okay, so Rawls just keeps trying to imprison. That's okay. You know, we'll even caught them score, so like, Bird doesn't get the first move. Oh, perfect. We're in the red. It's asleep. It's confused. They don't know what's going on. Like a caveman that does not woke up after being deep dogged from ice. Alright. If this don't do it, nothing will. Alright, 
Bert, you're mine. Come. You're part of the family now. Excellent. <laughs> Alright, now the fight's just free. Oh, it's starting attacking now. Okay, works for me. What to do with that C dot? I'll toss a confused race towards it, I guess. Putting them to sleep. Big. It's huge. That rock smash. Interesting. For one damage. Alright, let's go beat up the rods. We're gonna bully the rods. And that's fine. As long as they don't try biting. Okay, I appreciate that the rods just gave me so many free turns. Oh, okay, well, there's the bite. Maybe I... Maybe I... Actually, no. We do this. Well, actually, I have two turns. Okay, see so that. No, no. Skip Bloom goes, beats up. Makes the finish. No bite, retaliation. Getting the fur off this guy is kind of huge. It means trying to grind this guy later is so much safer because, uh, you know, I no longer need to worry about that fur just uh, doing some stab strength or anything. And it'll just be his team of, what's it, Nosleaf, Curlia, and Machoke, the three Pokemon. I'm pretty sure he'll lead with, uh, uh, what's it, Curlia and Nosleaf. Pretty huge. I don't know if he had the force to replace the fur, but probably does. And there we go. That's game for Kale. Now we can move on with the story. The shadow Pokemon's mine now. Right there. Going back to his cave. I should have let that play. Uh, right. I want to actually go back to outskirt. Find myself some balls. That's eight more balls. Mm. You know, we may as well drop by Fennec. May as well drop by Fennec. this a lot. We have two reserves here. The early game is going great, honestly. Let's see. Um, um, like, my, what's special defense? Minus attack or something? 
Let me check that nature. Let me see what that nature is. Oh, yep. Plus special defense, minus attack. A little bit of a shame. Means the Shadow Balls will hurt slightly less now, but it can tank a little more special hits, so. Not a terrible trade off. Beyond, Quirky. Okay, so it's neutral here on Slugma. Hmm, not sure if Slugma's gonna stay in. Now that I have, like, Sleep Powder. Sleep Powder is just a lot more reliable. Well, Beyond is 100% accurate at the risk of one turn later, but I'd say skip ones are, in general, easier mon to use. But Flamethrower is nice. But anyway, drop it. Now we up our power. This is a great power spike. For it. Honestly, Mischief is also kind of nuts. The ghost typing kind of making clutches. Alright. Makita's just gonna have to stay around in the back. The man just collapsed. Silva, you've gone too far. Hmm. There's one thing I don't like about the fast forward. It distorts the audio quite a bit. If there's a way I can do that. So it doesn't just no, it's always gonna sound like that. Maybe. One of the gears is missing. Put our gear back. 30 years of cranking gear. What a career. Okay. The to do now. We have Mega Train. Good. Burret has run away. Is that one of the what is the other ability that Fert can have? Furret. Can it get another ability? Also 62 attack. Hmm. Not sure. Is that low roll? I feel like I got 70s on 70 attack on Fert one time. Not sure though. Now, let's see. Could have keen eye. Hmm. Well, both situational abilities. Okay. So there's only one encounter left here, and it's Flappy. You want Flaffy. Yeah, I want Flaffy. You put away Crokinol maybe for Mirror B. Okay. Go ahead and try and grab Flaffy. Shroomish. 
75% miss. Okay. Works for me. I can try again. Hit it this time. Very good. That's a Mega Dream will take it down, so. Let's go another Mega Dream. Then we go into first. And then great ball. And if it don't come in, it don't come in. But we got good odds here. Sleep, great ball, red. Red HP. I should have made Katu skip with my first priority. Then I could have got maybe Quagsire. <laughs> That was my mistake. I should have went straight for Skip Loom. Okay, well, at least I can use Skip Loom to just uh, beat up that Quagsire. Since Pirate Coliseum is just a little, what's it, prelude to the next little bit. Gonna be fast forwarded. Let's see, Mr. Piss goes in. Yeah, we're just gonna leave with our shadows. Yeah, I think this makes sense. Pirate Coliseum Battle 1 against Hawks. Mm -hmm. Ooh, we almost have Shadow Ball. Just one more little bar and Shadow Ball. Okay, 20 hits. 20 hit points on a crit. Not terrible. Forward them again. Speed run the Coliseum. Not to meditate. I think that would cause me to go switching out. And surf. I do love the surf animation. Oh, that lives? Not to live? Press it. Oh, what's that hidden power? It did a decent amount of damage. Oh, hey, a medic just pop. You're not half bad, you. Plus an electric. That's a good reason for a crocodile to switch out. We'll switch into forest. Okay, Howler. Interesting. Goes to absorb against Mischievous instead of what was Crokinaw switching for it. Hmm. 
Okay, plus two. It kind of hurt a little, but not too bad. I read a post that they're like, well, what, what do people think is the most average Pokemon? The most average looking, most average stat-wise, most average just Pokemon that exists. And the Electric Manetric line was one of them. An Electric type, it's like, the design's like fairly simple. Nothing too unique like Luxray. It's just there. I kind of like Electric and the Manetric line, but I do kind of agree with that assessment. It is fairly average. One cool thing about it though, it can learn Flamethrower. So that's pretty cool. There's Flamethrower on grass types. Like, it doesn't really add meaningful coverage, but an Electric type using Flamethrower? That's pretty cool, honestly. But that bumps it up one tier. Okay, bang on Goldeen. We still don't have like <laughs> it's crazy. We still don't have that shadow ball. Point. Ooh, magnoid. Okay. Magnum I'm I'm getting some PTSD already. Magnemites and freaking electrodes. I think this guy has a bolt over hidden in his back. Ooh, that surf just bounced off mischievous. Okay, yeah. Ooh, good stuff. Okay. Bop, holding down. Next is Umbreon. Oh no, it's just the deli bird. Okay, chillin'. And there we have. We have our Shadow Ball. Present is a normal type move, so it wouldn't hurt Mischievous regardless. The Umbreon's just gonna eat those for breakfast. Alright, Shadow Ball. Very good. One hit? Oh, it lives! That deli bird lives! That deli bird lives. It's crazy. Ooh, 666 XP. Double the number. Okay, there we go. We have Toxic now. Mm. Next thing. Next up, next up. We have a Yamma encounter. Yamma's kind of been an invasive mod. I have not caught it within the like the past two attempts. Or maybe no, I don't think I caught it, but two attempts. But uh, Yamma could be helpful. Level 33. And then for a gate in particular, it could be useful fodder against that. That awful hit on top. So that's what I'm thinking. What will happen? It's a otherwise pretty cruddy, otherwise. But it will serve a purpose there. Nowhere? Okay. Alright, your whole goal is to wait powder on the Yamma. How much damage? Okay, that's not too bad. No works for me. Oh wait, but I can't sleep in an uproar. Uh. Oh crap. A oh, crap basket. Uh, that's... And it's got compound eyes? Okay. Um, alright. Not cotton support. Oh, oh right, it's random. It missed. Uh, okay, so calm down. If it tries clicking uproar again, we're just gonna do that. Perfect. Uh, 
perfect. Gonna have for a chill for a turn. Then we're gonna hit that sleep powder. But I like to see. Mage Lift. Let's switch it. gonna be so huge actually. Without healing in battle, that's kinda of just huge. Yeah. Oh Croconaut's oh right, Croconaut is faster than like the ones that skip them at the moment. I'm just gonna make it slow. Give it some gut. Now its speed is fully dropped. Broken is taking a little bit of damage. Let's go into Mischievous. Oh, and 10 PP on Mega Drain. Not a lot, but okay. Use ray, sleep powder. Hmm. It's got the lowest attack. Skiplum has the lowest attack out of everyone. 43, 36. Yeah. So Skiplum could probably get one Shadow Rush in. Mean look. I'm just being a bully to this Yen look. Okay. Uh, never mind. It can't. Okay. I was a bully for no reason. Okay. Damn. Okay. Well, uh... You know what? It's okay. Yep. Got the H file for hyper mode. Yeah, that was a little awkward. I was pretty confident in Shadow Rush just leaving it on a slip. Guess I high rolled or it just really couldn't take it. Hmm. Oh shit, have tested that. I just saw like what's it, Surf bouncing off of it. And that was Crokinol with Mystic Water stab, so. I assumed it. Like, okay, if it's taking that little damage, I'll probably take a Shadow Rush. Oh well. Not a big deal. Not a big deal. We are still in it. Yeah, at this point, 
I can't decide. Fur is gonna have to come. Yeah, Fur wants to get XP right away, so. Bad thing. Okay, sir. And then sir should just pop them both. Mm -hmm. Surprisingly, traffic slips. Interesting. Switch to Espeon, and I think that's it. Uh, let's see. We should have Slugma and Makuhita in the reserve. Oh wait, no, we also have Flappy in the back too. We have Pocket Flappy. So, Broken All. Probably gonna get switched out for Flappy for the, this part. Well, not until... Uh, what's this? Not until I go up. Pass this part first with the Mantine and the Remoraid. And then we get the Flaffy on the team. But yes. Good things in store. So no losses so far. But that's pretty good. This is looking pretty good. Mm. Seven fifty one, but it's a resist for the water stuff. Mm. But we're gonna need taunts. Fifty five, fifty six. That's a first, and it's my fastest one so far. I am now just thinking. Uh, screw it. We need Flappy to just go and get the bar down. Skip looms? Yeah, skip looms done. Broken all's done. This first guy is gonna be ground type. Yeah. Yep. Alright, gets a free bar. Apple bar progress. Crit. Okay, that could have been worse, but that's alright. Okay. Oh, what can you do? Arbosh down. I think, uh. Yeah. I was like, contemplating. Uh, I don't want to let it try and get a crit. I'm just gonna bop it. Focus energy, kinda scary. Heightened crit chances. Okay. Let me just. Oh, let's see. Let's get some levels on. SP on Umbreon.
Yeah. Remorade and Magnemite. Yeah, it's a 32, 33. Let's be on it, Umbreon gotta help out a little bit. No crit. No crit? That's a 5% chance of not critting. Ow. Thanks, game. <laughs> I remember it kinda hit hard, honestly. What's that side beam? I'll listen to us Manting for this next coming segment. I do I think Manting is worth an ultra ball. Die on sight. <laughs> I'm so scarred by Voltorbs. Okay, first coming out. Now I can get XP. Plus 389. Sounds nice when it's like fast forwarded. Like this whole building theme. Got a different vibe on it. Okay, Flappy Umbria. We're gunning engines. Okay, this is perfect. Taking a switch. I'm not though. Three hits. That's okay. You take your time, Flaffy. Rage. Four times. Crazy. Flappy is just not going anywhere, huh? It's just not making any kind of like moves. It's slow. That's not a crit? It's crazy. 5%. 5% chance of not critting. What happens if... 
close to the shadow Pokemon don't get XP until there's uh, two bars. First two bars are cleared out of five. What happens to their XP? Does it just go straight into Umbreon? Does it? What happens if both are shadow Pokemon and don't have? Do you just lose XP then in that case? Hmm. Sounds like that second case was true. There's two shadow Pokemon L and their bars aren't depleted by two. And then yeah, it sounds like wasted XP. That sounds right. Okay. It'll be worse just walking around just running like crazy for this and perfect only. Okay. Beep, 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 beep. Ooh, and Thunderwave is good too. Alright, let's see. I'm gonna expect an ice move to come out somewhere. Let's hit the snow run. Powered snow. Expected. Oh shit, Flappy's frozen solid. 10% chance. Can I still call out? It'd be funny if it didn't like respond because it was frozen. Alright, with well, that interlude's over. Icy win. So am I. Uh oh. Alright, Flappy. Your number is up. Broken all, you're in. Snow run into Glalie. Another, another example of average mon. Literal 80s in every stat. All his base stats, 80. Nothing done well, nothing done good. Nothing done poorly, I should say, actually. Double bite. I don't think double bite could be, be fun. Thunder wave and then bite bite. That's a lot of flinching chance. How did this happen? Honestly, I'm surprised he got the frozen. I haven't got poisoned. Bite a couple poison stings earlier. Those are like 30% chance, but then the 10% freeze chance hits. That's pretty funny. One revive. One revivify. Okay, one more. Or actually, no, this is the... There's gonna be an Oddish and then a Horsey. Yeah, Oddish Horsey. Espeon wants to come out first. <laughs> actually, Oddish Horsey, yeah. We'll do this, skip him. Then a Sandshroom in the pocket. Wait, I don't the horsey. No pedal dance for that Oddish. Horsey might get a dragon dance off. Let me put it to sleep right after. Okay, sleep powder. And then Mega Drain on Sandshrew. Espeon's just a great powerhouse. Okay, so it lives. That's fine. Because I'm not living another turn. It's too slow.
I don't even know what it's gonna do. Maybe slash? Give me swipe. I will compel someone like you to come here just for the sake of getting trashed by me. And we confident, are we? Strict is such a weak move. And base power, if I remember. Such a weak move. Why is it even exist? Flavorful for tentacruel and tentacruel, but man, I think just bad attack moves. I don't even get why it's that low base power. And it's so funny. We are safe. We are safe. It really hit the whole five yards, huh? We really hit the whole five yards. Okay. Multi hit, multi attack, multi hit attack moves. I've just been like having a field day with me. Lefty. Turned the tables on me. That I did. But a Uno reverse. Okay, so honestly. We are in a good spot here. I don't remember how they start, but... I think the Remorite train is first. Start here. We'll lead with uh, Skip Loom and... Alright. And then... I was going to go back, but I don't think I can buy any more balls. But I also feel pretty dumb if the building resets because I have to walk all the way back up again. I mean, it's XP, but like it's also not something I want to reset now. I don't want to go back and do that. At 14. I think we got good odds here. And a 30, 31, 31 for Umbreons and Espeon. Okay, so I think we got good odds here. Darling, aren't you one of Dukin's people? And uh, they're just bullying him. Poor dude. So she's a uh, Remorade. Read. Remoraid and Spinarak. Hell. Uh. Okay, for it doing that. Fine. Yep, leap power is good. I doubt I realistically hit this thing. I mean, Skeplum could hit it. 
but it's also 10 levels below. I have a hard art. Ooh, what's it? I need a crocodile instead. Surf away. Even surf might just. No, uh, it's resistant, so. Alright, we'll, we'll gonna give it a try. Temperate, still fast, and then spin rack, even after one agility boost. Crazy. Okay, I guess it was a good thing I just fucking swapped out. But Aurora Beam would absolutely just not make uh, Skip Room's day. Okay. Eh, we'll do it. We'll call for it. One great ball should be enough. If not, the memory goes. We won't have bubbled artillery anymore. But that's okay. That's a trade off I'm willing to let go of. I shouldn't have doubted myself. Doubting myself is how I get myself killed, probably. <laughs> Unbelievable. You're no ordinary trainer. Were you hired by Duke now? His bodyguards? You best be prepared. Alright, so here's Nanteen. Hey, Pong. Got a sleep powder in the Nanteen. Got a rush A Pong. Tank, whatever the heck is coming. Astonish. Okay. If you want to avoid skip them, just taking unnecessary damage. Even though it can heal up with Mega Drain. Switch out. Uh, 42. Alright. We'll take Espeon. Espeon's gonna be like a thing that just beats up mind bend confusion. Ow, 20 damage. You're joking me. You're joking me. It lives on one. Eh, hey, you know what? If it's gonna astonish again, broken off. Okay. 
Let's minimize damage. Yeah, there we go. Now that I know that Mantine does not actually have wing attack, I can pretty much safely put it in whenever at this point. Okay, for it. Alright, so that's the next target. Bubble beam. Or just dispense curls. Alright, that works for me. Confuse Ray Manting. And just hit yourself. I'm living on one. Actually, kind of fucked with my momentum. Oh, it doesn't have water absorb. Okay. Hit yourself, please. Okay. Thank you. I think Umbreon should switch out for Skip Blue. And we're gonna put on a Cotton Spore. I mean a Sleep Powder. Okay, Croconaw. He's under half. Sonic Boom, fuck. <gasps> A crit on that Yam was so huge. A crit on the Yam was so huge. Torrent, crit, stab, everything just came out right. Everything came out right. Okay. That's the momentum shift we need. That is the momentum shift I needed. Okay. Let's see. Now we just have to like beat it down a little. I do want to keep starters though. 
I'm gonna switch into Flaffy since Flaffy's full HP. Okay, so this is way close. Mega Drain, Mega Drain. Okay. Oh, I'm still confused. Okay, huge. Very huge. Um, who's faster right now? Oh, what? What am I even saying? Who's faster? But, if Sleep Powder misses, we have a status on it. Okay. Man came to sleep again. It failed, yeah, that's fine. Alright. And then with Great Ball. And that's our one chance. Red, sleeping, great ball. So let's see, I've been two for two for this guy. There we go, perfect. There we go, that's perfect. Unbelievable too. Okay, so this was a close fight. This was close. Much closer than I would have liked. Ooh. That was... Oh yeah, well... They full healed everyone, but... It was close. That was a nail biter. If the Crokinaw didn't land that crit, I'm pretty sure someone was probably gonna go down. That like... Ooh. That Yamma was 20 damage every turn. That was just not good. Ugh, thank you. Yeah, we know Dukin. Hey, look at you. Okay. Okay, so let's go down the elevator. Grab this. Hyper potions. Yeah. Okay. Uh, grab Crokinole. Put them away. And we put a Manti. I'm gonna go use the restroom quick after switching that out in a minute. Get some remorade. Okay, so honestly, this is going really well, all things considered. Broken off clutching up with a surf crit on the yam bomb. So, surprisingly, Mantine did not have Water Absorb. Might be a little harder to use, but Swift Swim is not bad. 72 Special Attack. That's a, like... But it did kind of hit hard on the, like, Bubble Beams. Huh. Let's take a look. Broken off. 49, yeah. 
So those bubble beans did come up pretty hard, honestly. 72. Espeon's 89. That's a crazy set. 72. This man seems kind of nutty. Kind of nutty. Okay, so. We now roll with this guy. Mischievous. We now need to get well fit. Well, fish is kind of a, a little bit doofus. Could be worse. Not really a. Okay, I think what I want to do is I want to intentionally put fur into shadow mode or hyper mode. I, I sure hope I don't have to like. So let's bounce out of here for a moment. Well, I suppose Mantine could also be the hyper mode. I don't think it's super who he does who. But because like what's the Mantine's got 50 something? 36, never mind. It's 56 defense I was looking at. So, we're hoping to get a hyper mode. Any hyper motors? Any? Okay, so Mantine's hyper moding. Wait, that's not conducive. Quick attack, is it? Crit? Okay, sure. Attacking move is water gun. That's okay with me. Blue swell blue. It was a crit. I did kind of wish Mantine had the water absorb. I do think it's better, but it is a ridiculously sturdy special side. So flip swim isn't bad. All right, but we got our thing. Got our guy. Got a fur and crit. And now we can go through that cave. We can go engage in the quillfish fight. Have a good luck. Alright. I get it. You guys weren't new recruits, just intruders. That guy earlier was too weak for it. How about you? Are you gonna keep me amused? Token. I'll keep you amused. Okay, it's got a golden. Okay, so big thing here is put that quillfish to sleep or neuter it quickly because minimized stress are not fun. Okay, it lives. works for me. I don't know which one it is. It's either Swift Swim or Poison Flame. And I don't really want to find out which is Poison. Let's 
and we just switch out for it. I'm putting Umbreon. So I can taunt it so I don't do minimize. Now we just set up the capture. Okay, so it's getting like the max turn sleep. That's pretty nice. Oh, should have just caught and spored it once. And now I'll wake up this turn. Yep, there it is. Cons four and taunt. Make sure I don't do that strat. Don't do that strat. Cancer. I'm busy. We'll make it hurt itself. Do a coin flip. Better? Okay. Sleep powder. Well, it's winning. It's winning over there, huh? Come on. Here we go. Sleep powder. minimize and then a whole like two turns of missing. This is actually unreal. <laughs> oh back up. Oh that's fucked up. That's fucked up. That's fucked up. Switch into my Umbreon. Or Manting. Oh, man. Okay. You know, it's been confused a long ass time. I'm surprised it's still confused. Should do it. It almost feels like playing the game on easy mode now, using all the sleep. Sleep is just so busted. It makes this significantly easier. Diplom's busted. Right ahead. That quilt push kind of hurt though. A crit shadow rush. Does not play. Oops. Elevators. Side is rock, hard rock. Mm. I mean, I can basically time it. There's a, I could not. The way how switching it works, I have one chance, exactly one chance of sleep powder. Because then it's whoever knocks out the loot cola before the Widow, then it goes into the Widow. And have like however long it stays asleep. Flappy's 47. I 
don't know how justified I feel. Leaving Sid a little around. Ooh, 72. Okay. Go fish in. I have choices. I have choices. It's impressive. to say. Alright, I'll leave Quillfish in as a reserve. Now we just start leveling Umbreon a little bit. 35 will be the cap I guess for Sudowoodo. in response to trauma. Too bad Dark is special. Eh, works for me. Too hot. Put it flappy. Really? Poison powder. Really gotta do it to me like that?
Tell me more steps. There we go. That was seven steps from outside. That was like 20 steps around. And up we go. Here we go again. This is a dead end area, but it's key. Uh, I mean, I think it doesn't actually get any XP. So, it might be better just doing something like this, where I just walk around with them. See, it didn't look dead. Use those move and look and you know, block successfully in a competitive environment. I'd be so interested to see what kind of situation led to where that was significant. Here's our Ultra Balls. I'm gonna reserve one of those for Entei for sure. Mm. Not sure how I feel about using an Ultra Ball pseudo widow, but it might be necessary. My SPM is passing in low set, or for it now, so. that guy out. And let's see, I believe this guy should have edit day. Right, twin. Yep, there it is. And bang on. 
Eight on these ones, nice. Do it with black, sleep powder. Okay, it's all mine. That's gonna be a nice little bump. If one goes, put an embryon. if I'm doing all this work. Go back. Heal. Huh, I actually got it stuck. Mr. Biz is almost there. Laughing is or almost. Yeah, so yeah, I'm taking a little bit of different approach. Here I'm just gonna try and funnel some XP into Orvon. I do want Croconaw. But Croconaw utility is more limited. Let's 
A bit more defense. Probably eight. Seven. Quillfish does have the bulk. I'm gonna actually go Quillfish over Manting here. The mirror beat fight. Manting does a straight up hard wall loaded color. But. Uh, what's it? Bubble Beam and I. I don't even remember. Third move. Got something. Supersonic. Not wing attack. I don't know what it is actually. Let me look at it. I remember. Nothing particular. Let's take a look. Oh, we can take down. So nothing significant. I'm gonna do Brokono. Brokono does have a better. Water types is too good. Okay. Hold on. No, hold on to me. That's gonna be my pocket mischievous. Alright, back up we go. Back into the cave. Skip them around. We can go down. Gonna battle us. So we want rewards. Nobody, so who cares? Plus three, okay. I get rain. Get one good. Turn it in. Ooh, what a read. Astonish. Consider yourselves lucky. It's funny that Espeon actually has a higher attack than Umbreon. It's so funny. Next one is gonna be a Dawn Spark. Eh, put Quillfish up, yeah. And does Quillfish have Swift Swim or Poison Point? Swift Swim. Okay, so this thing's gonna be fast. This Quillfish is gonna be uncontested in the rain that Ludicolo set up. Come to here. Oh, the Mary. Ah, uh, hell. Ah, double hell, actually. Alright, um... Okay. This is doable. Makes sense. I want that Dunsparce. Quillfish never going first. Ever. Mm. 
Why not do it? Okay. Wait, skip him. It's it. He carries a kill. Cacnea. Wakes up. Flaring. Okay. 50%. Ouch. Bloom bounces out of the fight. Put an Umbreon. Uh, quick attack. Uh, to do the trick. Think one secret power. Then we just pass on Furt. Goes to the okay. Um, let me think. What are my next steps? <laughs> I have to plan out those ultra balls pretty carefully at this point. So, afterwards, it's gonna be Swablo, Sudowoodo, and hit Monta. Okay. Assuming these are the only three that I can get, and then after back him, I'll go for a great ball. I'll go for a great ball. Okay. Very nice. Beautifully set. Okay. And now we have an Ultra Ball for one of Hitmontop, Dudowoodo, and Ante. Swablu can be caught with a Great Ball. Okay, we have so much options now. So I expect Mirror B to just you know, try and rip someone in here. I got pseudo Wudo. But 32, 32. I don't know, I think all stays because it might be five levels below. I'm gonna tell you it's not. <laughs> 46 isn't terrible. It's actually much better than Makuhita. Man, I never realized just how hard it is to use Makuhita. It is there. Oh yeah, and then Dunsparce, well actually, Dunsparce Pro, 53, 49. Not like absurdly tanky. It's mostly, most of his bulk is hell. Like fur, it's got like a similar amount of bulk, but it's faster. Let's take a look at that. One hundred and four, forty-nine, one hundred and nine, fifty-three, forty-nine, forty. Yeah, they got roughly similar bulk. They're in gray still. But yeah. It will have a good time smacking stuff for harder damage. It's also rash. Special 
attack is up. Like, Don's part is having its death. Flare, yawn, take down, fight. <laughs> okay. Yeah, Swablu. Swablu's got like 255 catch rate. That's like the max. Okay. That's about as high as it gets, honestly. Alright. We can do this. I'll put in Umbreon again. Espeon, I think. Espeon so it wants to come in on the fight. If we want to get that Pseudo Widow safely. Gotta come in, gotta burn reflect, bounce out. Okay. So the thing is, though, uh, yeah, let's get ourselves some XP. Get SP on the level. Duke is finished. It's the dawn of mirror B time. What a bandwagoner. What what does he not like about duking? Well, we'll eventually we get into more of those later, so. when I just like fast forward on everything. Yeah, we'll keep using Espeon. Use around the pine cup. Smoke screen.
double stick that game. Insult to injury. Oh, crit. Double crit. Crazy Crokinaw. Crokinaw hasn't seen action in a while. It's like, it's ready to go. And attack spam. Confidence took a hit. circling around this. There's like two trainers up there. Future sight from that, not to. It's kind of crazy. It doesn't last long enough for that. Where's that Pokemon? I'll never tell. Real Elite. Special defense. 45. This army has gotten a lot more even defense. Yeah. The last number I was just like super special defense. That's probably because I kept eating that low tad and the number or Espeon went down. Alright, let's see. No clue you managed to come out here.
I wonder if this accelerates the time in game too. I don't I wouldn't think it does, but there's all honestly a cheese tactic could be minimize on first turn. Or like first four turns, whatever. Wilfish just like tanks. Unless a leech seed happens. Leech actually yeah. Fuck me up, but Like once we get down to the last two little fellows, we couldn't skip with Yeah, okay. I know how I'm gonna handle this. That's the last guy before me B. Once I, I might actually go for a gate. Once I make a gate, I call it a night. Yeah. There's a crocodile. There. Oh, that's swap we just tanks it. Crits always scare me when I do them on the shadow. Like, I want to catch it. But anyway, the Swabler is going to be a good one. Bite, double bite. Flinch? Got two chances. And it won them both. Pretty good, Belden. Pretty good. Well played, well played. Bait on this thing is so high. There's no way it misses. And if it does, well, it wasn't meant to be. much prep work as I can. I can grind a little bit more for this, but I don't think there's a need to look do that. So we start off with quillfish and fur it. Fur it goes, baits them down until like it gets tired. Fish sets up with minimize so it can just be a pain in the butt.
arriva Hey people, going that way is a no-no What's it gonna do? Stop me Alright, come on Let's get your fight over with So I can move on to scrub I decided to work up a little perspiration yeah, I've been naughty. Alright. Four Liddy Color Squad plus Pseudo Wuda. That's a big feat, honestly. Level 29, 29. Level 29, 31, 30, and 35. I think that's his whole Liddy Color Squad. Minimize. We're just gonna be annoyed with quillfish. So that one's had Swift Swim then. Okay. Oh, crit. Perfect. Okay, so that. Ah, hell. Leech now. Yeah. And then Earth goes. Playing Umbreon. Minimize. Umbreon can just eat whatever. Minimize. Oh, okay. Now it's diving. Mm, what's if I'm... I don't imagine Crokinol just being super active in the fight, so... I'm gonna just come in. Take a dive. Why? Oh. Okay, so I just fucked up Crokinaw instead. I. Why did he go Mega Drain? And it crit. I cannot keep a starter alive. Yeah, just. Why did he? Okay, so that's on me. That's that was on me for being like greedy, just thinking he'd do water gun. Why did he go Mega Drain? Why did he Mega Drain? What? <laughs> oh, what? Was Mega Mega Drain and Water Gun have the same power? No, forty. It, it plus, it's right. Oh, what? I can't read this man. I can't read this man. The man cannot be read. And I just get hit with a fucking crit. It is just... Oh my god. Crokinaw, I'm sorry. I couldn't have read that stupid move.
And now this motherfucker just goes leech seed and fury swipe, like... What? And now he's gonna spend next turn. Is what? Still has three loot color. I'm just absolutely flabbergasted, man. I don't know what to say. Like, I don't know what to tell it. The man just decided, okay, I'm gonna Mega Drain. He fucking read me. He fucking read me. death. That's our first death. Me being just a dummy. I, I could have just kept the Umbreon in. Umbreon would take a crit mega drain. No big deal. I guess that's just me being like unnecessary. Razor leaf. And fucking hit after plus four minimize. This motherfucker. I truly cannot. No. Thirty one is the one with leech seed and rain. Okay, so that's the annoying one. Good to know, I guess, for future reference. Despite having done this fight like three times already. <laughs> I don't know what to do. I'm just gonna. I'm just flabbergasted. I lost this whole session. This went great, and then. Man, all the man decides to go. Yeah, I'm just gonna use my grass move. For no reason. It's raining. It's raining. Hey, okay, man tried to get two leech seeds off. That's fine. That Ludicolo can like do whatever. Gonna hit this one. Razorleaf is 95% accurate. How's it gotta hit twice the Razorleaf? This is some booty cheeks, Mirror B. I'm half tempted just to put another Minimize on. Cause this motherfucker hit again. Avocado. Blue. I'm putting on another minimize. I don't know. This man got God on his side, apparently. Hitting two razor leaves and then a crit of Mega Drain on my. Doesn't affect Skip Blue. Mm -mm -mm. The Shadow Rush should kill? Yeah, there we go. The other little Kodo spends its turn. Rain Dance. Uh 
Of course I missed. Why wouldn't I? I have another chance, honestly. Realistically speaking. Ludicolo. Rip. All right, sure. Uh, <laughs> I cannot believe I lost my crocodile in the stupidest manner. Dive and then rip Mega Drain. It might have died from a regular Mega Drain, to be honest. But <laughs> the crit was just like straight salt and wound kind of deal. <laughs> oh, come on, really? What? We're missing out on tempo, Quillfish. Reflect it's already gone. Holy shit. Maybe this is not worth putting up reflect. Bruh, right, not a 5%! 5%! What is this? What is this? 5% to not crit, because it's set up to 95% crit chance. And you're telling me I. It's like, no? No crit? I don't know, game. I don't know what you want from me. Is he the, just the starter killer? Because last time it was, what's it, Rock Slide crit from Pseudo Wudo. This time it's a Mega Drain crit. Either way, I'm kind of mega peeved. Yeah. I am peeved that I lost my starter in the stupidest manner. Ugh. And now I don't have surf spread. <laughs> no spread for surf. I mean, I have quillfish, but it's weak to earthquake. So bad. Honestly, looking at how this fight has progressed, I did not need to switch out Umbreon. There was no reason for me to switch out Umbreon. Had I done that, we have a Croconaw, a Prowligator, and that potentially stay with us to endgame. Well, it is what it is, I suppose. Pseudo Wudo, you better make this worth my while. If not, you're going down. <laughs> the Quillfish basically stayed up the whole fight with Minimize, that's fine. I lost the... <laughs> I'm on just being too aggressive with my switching. Thinking, okay. Like, I'll read it. It's gonna be like... Bro, if he just did dive, water gun, Croconaw would've lived. Then I live. <gasps> He's a starter killer. Starter killer.
reserves here but you know the first one to go down <laughs> the first one to go down crocodile I'm gonna take that mystic water off of me Yeah, it shouldn't be. I guess it should be another like 15 30 minutes. Well, I had fun with you, Crocodile. I really did. But I overestimated the Sudowoodo. Now that I had sleep uh, actually available to me and hitting. Umbreon, Espeon, they didn't really take damage. Pert was like around 60. I had plenty of sources. Well. Ah, <laughs> I don't know. It just feels bad. 1995. Pretty beefy, honestly. Damned if I have to use a mech cargo again. <laughs> All right. I put away a couple. Into rub. <laughs> you can tell us obvious lies, but we're not going to leave this safe place. Oh, thanks. You'll let us loose. I don't know, I don't care who you are, but thanks. See ya. They're not criminals. All criminals are free. Broken all had such a promising future, and I squandered it. I squandered it. I thought too hard on the read. I tried to read something that wasn't there. Oh, shut up, Fatty. I'm mourning my loss, old lady. Alright, let's see if we can knock out a gate. Two ultra balls. Silk Scarp. Okay, so Silk Scarp can go on to like fur it, but we have to get past Scrub. That's our big challenge for the remainder. Quick Law. Use 
put it on skip though. The teacher like four minutes. Prevent what's it? Kinda like encore ish. A little worse maybe. Cause if like him on yeah. Be nice if I could find him on with Let's see battle. Losing Crokinaw right before the whole purification chamber. Feels bad. Is he doing low kick? Why the fuck did it do that much damage? seems to be the trend. Not being able to keep a water Pokemon. I'm gonna grow. Oh, it's cutting. Cut me. Gonna shank me. Three turns in a row, that's great. <laughs> that's actually gonna keep that's so awesome. <laughs> Come on. Then the fight already. Good workout. Man. Old man luck, I swear. Lucky for three turns. Ew. We got a name Atlas. Let's see, he was Chad last time. This time he's gonna be Atlas. Like that Greek myth. And carrying the world on his back. Atlas. Mm-hmm. And then we 
nickname. Um, Espeon. What is Espeon gonna be? It blasts people. Mm. Psychic powers. Big damage. Oh, uh, what did I do? You know what? It's an elliptid. For all that Baldur's Gate I played. Actually, no, hold on. It gets to be Emperor. It gets to be Emperor. Atlas and Emperor make a good pair, honestly. Okay, now who am I gonna leave? Daycare. Put in Slugma. Slugma. Put in Slugma. Grinding is kind of meaningless against the uh, oh, what's it a uh, scrub? Because like none of your shadow Pokemon will really receive the benefit. So it'd be only for like the Espeon and Umbreon. Blah blah blah. I can wait. I spend so much of my time just grinding this whole circle area. Crazy. This guy. We just knock out the quag side straight away. Mega drain. Here we go. Flash. Emperor. Mm 
I want quailfish to I want it to have surf. So that way I can as a deer dude I know that's on his team. I know for sure that's a deer dude plus a clam pearl, so. Actually we might do the same thing here. Quailfish might actually be super helpful. Just to minimize on like both of his turns. 82. Honestly, not a special defense. It's comparable to like what's it? Umbreon almost at this point. Can't be serious right now. E e <sighs> You're telling me four times Mega Journey won't. I'm actually so baffled. <laughs> You're joking me. And now I can't even put that fucking hip top to sleep. I lost. Bro, what is it? I can't control Chris, but like, why did it? I'm so peeved. I just can't. I can't. It's always Chris. Like, I get that Skiplum has crappy defenses, but crit. Is this why it just goes down? Because I just lose. Here it might have gone down. Genuinely so sad. It was a great session, and then that skip bloom put a lot of work for me. Why is that quagsire so fucking lethal? It was supposed to be a one. You're telling me four times effectiveness? Grass stab. Mega drain. 
doesn't even do over half. It does like 40% is what I saw. Can't believe this. Fucking Quagsire. Quagsire has the nerve to just insult me by not getting caught. Then it just kills a member. Because like, fuck me I guess. Pastas, those Pokemon copy pastas. Pokemon is an unfortunate series of events. I, I, I feel it now. I feel it within all, all my soul. I now understand. I understand it now. That'll take down. <laughs> Jesus Christ, five fucking times. Calm down. Oh, yeah, I'm not feeling well. That makes two of us, huh?
Oh, totally. Third, knocked out. One, lays brought to life. Yep. Earlier. Okay, yeah. door. I'll we'll take that then. Five percent chance. Five percent chance. Shot that we just lost. All right. What are we gonna do? Emperor. Emperor kills until he can't. He reflects first turn or second turn. Yeah, whatever. We're just gonna ball it. Yes. All right, Pikachu. Go ahead. Fight your battle against the Hitmontop. Your 12 levels over. I don't know why you're using quick attack. One Thunderbolt probably like knocks him down. Two Thunderbolts probably do does it. <laughs> Uh... Ah, fuck, I... Well... But actually, yes. Minimize. Oh, he's just tossing that straight up. Cool. Cool. Oh, this is going poorly. I think hit my top's just gonna have to. No. Emperor, helping hand, trying to rush. Oh, you fucking joking me, really? <laughs> and just like that, Emperor dies. <laughs> fucking why not? Oh my god. This is going very poorly. Thanks, Quillfish. You, you really just had to go fucking hyper, huh? I mean, it wasn't gonna save Emperor, but... Uh Okay, we're just killing. There goes a surf. <laughs> Bro, every time I wanna surf. Every time I wanna fucking surf. Surf don't live.
Bro, Emperor cannot live until like fucking 36. <laughs> I forget this fucker has a why not. He's just evil. This guy's actually straight up evil. Should have declined. I should have just stopped for my. So did not expect him to just fucking send a hit on top. Great. That's his second mon in. Ugh. This is just a fucked up day. It was going pretty well and then everything changed within like 30-40 minutes. Emperor was doing well. Atlas could have gone down too. It's been like a third triple hit, triple kick hit, and then crit. Real fucked up day. Okay, so these two just straight up died. These two. Crit. This one was a result of me playing bad or thinking too hard. Man, skip. Just fucking quiet. Sorry, just being mean. Just a big. Fucking bully for some reason. Alright, so this is now the team. A little unorthodox. Huh? Amazing, but... Alright, let's go purify whoever is available. And call in that. Now, literally, that game is just gonna be, like, grinding. I'll be grinding up, so... I'll just relegate that towards uh, off-screen. Off... Uh, what's it? Yeah, the grinding's... I'm gonna relegate that off-screen. Um, got two. We have two guys. Hello? Oh wait, alright. Hold on, hold on. I remember. Wait. I gotta go talk to Celebi Nerd. Alright. Well, at least uh, knowing that, like, What's it? Because I killed him on top here, I can toss it later. Alright, now you're talking. God damn it. You're making me read my email. We got a lot done. Got a lot done. What you mean? I can't fucking make this. Mirror B and then a gate. Pretty good. Now we just gotta go through Dakim and then through Venus and then I'll be all caught up again. Alright, so I guess this is now my Espeon. 5,500. Two levels. Works for me. Alright. You know what this is. Anal beads. I expect great things, anal beads. Side beam plus shadow bell. Pretty good. Fur. Okay. Never. Iron 
tail. 8,000. Wow. 35. Good. I need this one. Drop. I reused it. Gotta reuse the Lydian's nickname. But on Earth. This one screams Chuck Energy. Ale. Okay. Solid set of moves here. Beyond mean look is probably. I don't know what else I can give. We give it to you. Not exactly amazing. And the man teams it a wudo and swablu. These are just gonna be <laughs> sad. I now have one water type. For granted, I knew I should have just listened to my gut. I should have just let you stay in the box. I should have just taken Antine. I should not have. Ah, <laughs> uh, Crocodile. You know what? I'm just gonna move Crocodile down. It was a crit, but like, it was just entirely. Might be Daniel against Ludicolo stinking. You tank two water hits. You got a surprise grass and Skip Loom. Skip Loom just straight up unfortunate. Backside just decided to be a bully. Still got Remoraid. Still got this guy. Still got one water. 45 attack. That attack seems pretty good, honestly. Well, oh, anyway. That's a moment for next time. Next time. Probably shouldn't keep this grinding. I did the stuff on screen. But anyway, so what I'll probably do is maintain Sudo Wudo and Swab Blue. I'm just going to purify them off screen. Every Shadow Pokemon is probably going to get purified off screen. And it's probably going to happen. But otherwise, time to call it a night. I'm the color of the night. <laughs> Crocodile. Get blue. Uh, I'm gonna go cry off stream now.